Pardon my appearance, but I just got a notification from Amazon saying that a package has arrived, but I didn't hear any doorbell rings or even knocks. So what the fuck? I'm walking downstairs now towards my door to see if that is the case. Again, pardon my appearance, I must look like I'm homeless right now. I'm already borderline homeless as it is. Why do they do this, man? There is definitely a package here. I'm gonna not show you it so that just in case. It is cold outside. But that's I know you're Canadian. All right, new lens. And that's what the new lens look like. And now we're ready to go. So as usual, uh, I'm here at uh, Shepherd West Station. And actually, Kevin came here before um, William did. So would you like to tell him what's up? Yeah. All right, fine. But yeah, Ke but yeah, William is late, so you know what that means. Fuck you! I don't bother saying it anymore. I just repeat the original one. You can't ever, <laughs> you can't ever beat the original. Um, just like whispering. <laughs> Fuck you! It's not just gonna be a pop quiz or anything, but don't forget that because that does actually come back into play. But um, Patrick is. Uh, I don't know if Patrick's coming with us today because he apparently missed his initial train or bus because he's from Bradford. So you know he's uh, not as Asian as we are. <laughs> but uh, yeah, he's uh, he should be coming um, unless he tells me otherwise. But uh, today, if I if I understand the situation correctly, we will be seeing Tomb Raider. So uh, yeah, we just gotta wait for the other two jackasses now, and then we'll get going. So yeah, William's here so, now too. There we go. But since you're late, fuck you. <laughs> okay, seriously though, let's get moving. Something else that I found out earlier today that I'm low-key cheesed is that William has the PG1s on right now. <laughs> William has the PG1s on right now and I'm just like, fuck. But, but it's all good. Right now we're at Yorkdale, or at least the station. And uh, we're, uh, we're just gonna wait for Pasha to come. He's gonna be here hopefully within 20 minutes or so. So it's not much of a wait. So we'll check in soon. So literally we've been here for like I want to say three minutes and we were just disguised and we were just discussing where to go and uh, Pretty much instantly the three of us were just like yeah, let's go to let's go to the food court. So We're fed as fuck So after about not too long of, of deciding we're all just gonna get New York fries, but uh, I guess we're just gonna leave Kevin at the tables for the time being meanwhile, we're gonna go get food now so Yeah so much like arriving first, I also get to eat first. Still no whereabouts in regards to where um, Patrick is, but uh, yeah, all I got was just poutine. I'm waiting for everybody else to come back first. Yeah. So I gotta, I gotta make sure that I cut off the phone number, but that means that Patrick's late. So, you know what that means. Fuck you! Alright, so lunch is over, so now we're gonna walk around the mall. Of course, mall, of course, mall, of course. Since we are Asians and we are geeks, we're gonna go to EB Games, or as we like to call it, Gomez. So we finally have an update. Patrick just uh, texted me and uh, he's not gonna get here until two. The time is one. So uh, yeah, we're not gonna be able to see the showing that we wanted to, but I guess we'll figure out what we're gonna do on further notice. So William, tell them what you just found. A fidget spinner case. That's funny. And it's only the case. Yeah, it's only the case. And you can get them here. Also 50 cents Wow, each. 50 cents. I should just buy one right now. <laughs> What Kevin just said, what Kevin just said was you get like a whole entire like setup for just a dollar. Yo, fuck it, I'll, I'll get one. Fuck it, I'll get one. I'm gonna bring it back. 
You wanna bring back the fidget spinners? Yo, look how much it cost originally. $13, now it's 50 cents. Nah, man, we're gonna bring back the yeah. fidget spinners. It's 2018. Yeah, remember, bro, I bought mine for seven. Oh my gosh. So William got his for seven, I got mine for like 10, I think, and then. Oh, you got yours for oh, well, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I got mine for 10. Yo, how much did you get your fidget spinner for? I forget. Lies! It was like 20 something, right? 20? Right? This guy, because he's talking. Yeah, that's what's up. 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 Yeah, Probably not though. I read comic books. Probably not though. I but see, I'm, I'm just... I'm serious. Oh yeah, it is, yeah, it is. See, I'm so poor, I don't even read the comic books. I should just sit there and I read it. Hold up. I don't even read the comic books. I should just sit there and I read it. I don't even read the comic books. I read it. I don't even read it. I read it. I don't even read it. I read it. Read it. Read it. Read it. What the fuck? See, I'm so poor, I don't even read the comic books. I should just sit there and I read it, and then I never buy it. And then I just come back and remember what was last page I was reading. That means we still read it. I'm <laughs> oh, sorry, I meant I don't buy it. You're right. I don't, I don't, I don't buy it, but I do read it. That's how I get away with it, because I want to feel the physical pages. I want to feel it. So, yeah. <laughs> what? Can you feel He wants to feel it, like how Patrick wants people to feel his hands <laughs> on their bodies. I believe my art is an extension of myself. So when people view my art, no, when people feel it, I hope they feel my hands on their bodies. Once again, make sure to watch your documentary. I'll link it right over here in the corner. Yeah, this guy showed up and it's like 2, like 15 when he showed up. So like we can't do anything. Okay. So this is a flop. Fuck you, Patrick. Okay, so this is the current situation. I'm gonna have to head home first because I'm walking with a limp. I'm not sure exactly what's going on with it, but there's something wrong with my left foot. I think I might have sprained or potentially even broke a toe. And it's hurting like a bitch right now, so I'm gonna go home first. See if it's because of my selection of my shoes or if it's actually because it's genuine damage. Hopefully, it's a... Uh, Hopefully it's something major, and hopefully it's just a shoe problem, and I can just swap for another pair of shoes and I should be fine. Um, if it is my foot, then I'm fucked, basically. But, again, hopefully everything's gonna be fine. First things first, sorry for being poorly lit. Uh, thankfully I do have this wide lens now, so I can shoot in my room if I must. Um, the thing is, I would shoot in the other room with all the fancy lights and shit, but um, that would require me to set up all the lights and shit, and I can't really fucking walk on both my feet right now. So. How bad is the pain and what is the pain? The pain is in my left foot, specifically, um, I wish I had a shoe so I could at least demonstrate you where it is because I don't really want to show it to you because it's kind of gross looking. Um, but essentially my forefoot on the outer side, on the uh, lateral side, is swollen and throbbing like crazy. It looks like straight up purple, almost like bordering on a tumor level. Plus, it's all like fucked up looking. I just, I can't explain. There's like calluses on one edge. It's, it's disgusting. Um, so what that means essentially is, if you think about it, your lateral side of your forefoot, that's pretty much like what you use to walk with. Um, which, so I can't really walk on that foot. <laughs> uh, my, cr my crutch just slipped. I can't really walk on that foot unless I just use the very, like, ankle and the inside of my forefoot, like the medial side. And that's really not how you're supposed to walk. So because of that, I put a lot of pressure in my on my foot when I walk because I'm a heavy dude, and that's how it hurts. Um, in regards to how it occurred, remember that thing I showed you earlier to keep, to remind you to like keep in mind of. Fuck you. That is probably what fucked me over. Basically, what I did to get that shot to whisper into the microphone. Um, was I climbed a, a bit of a ledge? I don't mean climbed. I climbed. I mean stepped on top of a ledge. And I guess my foot kind of rolled a weird way and that is what caused the strain and a little bit of swelling and my stubborn ass thought it was nothing and I can continue to walk the whole entire day. What you didn't see during the whole entire small vlog be between me at Shepherd West Station and getting to Yorkdale and, Will and Patrick arriving, that was actually about four hours of standing and walking, barely any, uh, barely any sitting and that 
is probably what fucked over my foot.